So this year's challenge was about how to sustain a world of 10 billion people by the year 2030. And so our project, we decided to biodegrade um, plastic waste and produce energy from it. We learned about a specific enzyme that's actually found in bacteria found in landfills in Japan. We were sitting in the library um, when we found out that the two byproducts of this reaction were methane and carbon dioxide, which are pretty bad gases. So we were about to throw the idea out and then like, I realized, wait a minute, but if you can get energy from this, there's a, like a potential solution here. I care about this project because I care about the earth. Everyone sees all the plastic that's accumulating outside. All of, us, all of us know there's going to be reparations for that. Not only in our community in Corvallis, it can also affect people in such as places in Indonesia, where the plastic pollution is very high. I'm excited about the Grand Challenge Scholars Program because it gives me a chance to try to make a big impact on the world. It provides um, an opportunity to work with other engineering students that are also interested in tackling these grand challenges. The whole idea of the, the Global Grand Challenge was to present an engineering idea through like a business pitch. And so we were developing our business like models and we're having these like web seminars on like how to present a business model, how to conduct customer interviews, and how to get your idea up and going. And so we hope that our solution will um, allow us to create a more sustainable society. And I feel like all engineers need to know that they can change the world because it's, it's in our hands.